milk ashes spitting cobra this morning. Could be getting a wet day, but as you can see, the time was still happening. Good party going on. So, come to Otamu, do a snake safari, come to the snake farm, but you can also have a good party. Lots of ashes spitting cobras. How many do you have in Terry? More than that. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Casal putting parafilm on the funnels. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Bobo's getting his mask ready. We're ready to go. Already spitting. That's ah, a big snake. I missed filming it, but look at that. A spit from the cobra. All that is venom. This is venom from two snakes. This is the amazing thing about ashes is they give huge amounts of venom. This still isn't much, but a lot more than what we get from most other snakes. So you get asked quite often, why do we need three people to hold the snake? Jerry holding the sharp end there, Gombo with the tube and the body, the long snake, I've got the rear end here, and the next most dangerous bit, the bum. They'll sometimes poop all over you, so we don't want that, we try and hold that closed. So we've done 17 snakes, rashes, spitting cobras, and that's our total amount of venom, which is a huge, huge amount of venom. The equivalent from Egyptian cobra, which is about 30 snakes.